If they got our prime minister, I don't know what it's going to be. But if they got our Trump, if they got our Donald Trump, if they got our Porto Cristo Miller, if they got our PJ Pascal, bless the name of the Lord. If they got our Ham, lay the ball in. Right? If they got our name, the Governor General, bless the Lord. Our biggest guest is here. Can I hear you give me some more glory? Can I hear you church say hallelujah?
But hence, we are before you this day. We are a community church. You please us, my God, wherever we worship strategically for your purpose. To win souls, to be a saving station. To win souls of your kingdom. And as we come, Lord, the things that are happening around us in this community of Bulbe, it is of great concern to us. Our hearts are bleeding. We grieve with those who grieve. Sometimes, my God, we have to perform the rites of burial over these who have died. We have seen the tears, hallelujah, of those who are suffering. Lord God Almighty, the Holy One of Israel, the God of Heaven, the all-powerful, the almighty. We know today that there is nothing, Lord, that you cannot do. We lift our faith and confidence in thee. And we ask these petitions of thee because we believe, hallelujah, that you are able to do them and even more. You warned us in your scripture. You warned us, my God, that in the last days, perilous time will come. There will be a time when my heart shall feel them because of fear. As it was in the time of Noah, so shall it be in the end. Men will be going around making merry. No love in the heart. The love of many shall work school. But, oh God, you promise to preserve your own. Today, Lord, amidst all of that, we cry for mercy. Among our people, we are a nation, Lord, that is bleeding. We are killing our one another. My God, as if we are having civil wars. Jesus Christ of Nazareth, your blood was not shed on Calvary's cross in thee. So we pray today, Lord, as a church, as a people, as a community. My God, that it is even one of those who have gone astray, who have allowed themselves, my God, to be used by the enemy of souls, the grim reaper, who continues to reap souls. Yes, Lord, for the king of hell. We are praying, Lord, that we will extend your hand of mercy. First and foremost, in there we are. They are our children. They are our young men. They are the fathers and the husbands. Yes, Lord, and the teachers and the ministers of tomorrow. Oh, Lord God, the path that we have chosen. Yes, Lord, it is he could see as if it's a part of no return. But I pray, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, that you will release your only angels. Not only in this community of Bullman. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord, I pray that you will grant a visitation in these camps. These killing camps. My God, in these camps. You will change, mighty God, the narrative among them. You will open their eyes so that they might see, mighty God, that if we bite and devour one another, after a time, there will be none of us left. I pray, Lord, that your wisdom from above may touch their hearts. Yes, Lord, to help them to recognize that it makes no sense. Yeah, Lord, to live wild and die young. And then to recognize, Lord, that life is a gift from you, Lord, the Almighty God. And that is why Christ came when the adversary caused death to be pronounced upon us to die that we might live forever. Jesus Christ of Nazareth, grant a visitation in this community. 
I'm praying, Lord, for your mercies today. Upon your people. Our communities, one by one, are becoming full stones. People are afraid to come out of their houses if they have no need to do so. They are afraid to walk on the street at night. Hallelujah. Our children, our blessed Lord, are living in fear from the sound of gunshots in our community. This mighty God is like an epidemic. It is worse than the one that we are fighting today. For it is all over our island. But we, the church of the living God, we come against it right now. In the name of Jesus. We plead the blood of Jesus. Against our forces. For we recognize, Lord, that we are not fighting a physical battle. It is an enemy of souls at war with your with your prize creation. Pray, Lord, that your angels will teach us. They will, oh my God, commandeer these communities. They will curfew these communities. The police, they are sometimes helpless. They don't have the answer. The army, they don't have the answer. It would be easy, Lord God, to just do a wipeout. But my God, that would not be right. Two rounds cannot make a right. They don't have the answer. The government does not have the answer. The opposition does not have the answer. I am standing here today. I don't have the answer. Hallelujah. It is like our back. Hallelujah. It's against the wall. But oh God, when we have nowhere to turn, we know who we can look to. We know we can look to thee. Hallelujah. You never think. You are the author and the finisher of our feet. Elijah prayed and it did not rain. Then he prayed and it rained. My God, we are praying today in the name of Jesus that the killing field will cease. The killing will cease. Gunmen will have an holiday. They will show them your weapons. As your scripture declares that you can turn them into plowshares and tools of farming, but there shall be no more war. We are praying, God, in the name of Jesus. For we are tired of God the bloodshed, that the war will cease. In the name of Jesus. We are praying, God, we are pleading the blood against these forces of evil, these demonic forces. That is going about taking hold of our young men and some young women. My God, you are facilitating the crime. Yes, Lord, we come against them now. We curse you, you demons of darkness. We rebuke you in the name of Jesus. Starting in Bundy, we pray. That your angels, hallelujah, hallelujah, yes, Lord, will be released from him for this purpose. This is not something that we can handle. So we come to you now. Yeah, Lord, as we think about it now, more and more we recognize that we are helpless. Who do we look to? We look to you. Hallelujah. Take the wheel. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Help us to allow you to be the driver. Help us, Lord, to allow you to take charge of our homes. Let the people of Bundy. Yeah, Lord, those who are living in fear. Let them 
to be the one in charge, to be Lord of your lives, for we need a change. There must be a difference. We can't continue this way. Yes, Lord, I'm praying, my God, that this five miles church will be on a curfew from your holy angels. The church is a seeding station. Let those that allow themselves to be used and be captured by the enemy run to your altar. My God, I surrender to me. It is not impossible. You have done it many times. You can do it again. Do it for us, Jesus, we pray. Yes, Lord. You said, Lord, that your key for this world to bring peace and goodwill to all men. We are praying for peace within our nation. Hallelujah. This epidemic has spread. My God, far and wide to every community. If it continues, Lord, it's just a matter of time before we feel the effect right here in Shooters Hill. But we come against them right now. We declare in the name of Jesus that the enemy shall not prevail. The blood of Jesus is against every blood of the adversary. We rebuke every blood of the adversary. We comfort prayers in the name of Jesus. Every blood of Satan.
there's a report of a bit. And we're doing a thing this morning. Full bay is bleeding. I want to commend the good people of Shootism. The police report, police report, that Shootism is the best, the safest community in the entire Full Bay area. Come on, give it up for Come on, give it up for the people. Of shooting We need to continue to pray for the young men of this community. The people in Shooting Hill are good people, God fearing people. And the church wants to say to the people of Shooting Hill don't let unscrupulous behavior of our people destroy your good community. Anything you know, report it to the relevant authority. Don't wait until you're a victim and you get concerned. That is what happens all the time. People are not mindful of what's happening around them until it gets to the door. Be responsible citizen. I want to go to stand in the presence of Almighty God at this time. You know, Pastor has prayed and has touched heaven. And I want everybody, children and everybody, we want to sanction that prayer. Come on, everybody, please stand. Children, come on, those who are sleeping, wake them up. If you have a baby, come on. I understand. If you don't understand with your baby, I understand I'm speaking to those. No, no, you can't be able to sit with the baby. I'm speaking to those who are able to stand. And I want you to lift your hands. And together we're agreeing that the bloodletting in the nine miles, the ten miles, the eleven miles, in St. Thomas, in St. Andrew, in Kingston, in St. Catherine, in Trelawney, in Westmoreland, in St. James, in St. Anne, in Carrigo! in Manchester. We just been told, even though the police is somewhat playing it down, that, that uh, in, in Manchester, uh, the, the great ground community, the gang leader was arrested and that they have sent a message to the police to say that they are going to kill one person per day until the gang leader is been released. We come against it and that the man in the name. We come against crime and violence that is perpetrated. This Pokemon belongs to church, belongs to the name of Jesus. Speak against it. I don't hear the church. Open your mouth and denounce. We denounce crime and violence and corruption in the name of Jesus. We come against killing. We come against gun man, gun woman, rape man, rape a man. We come against drug peddlers and murders and crime and indiscipline and lawlessness in 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 Bulbay, in Jamaica, by extension, in the name.
the Lord showed up with the story. He said they took us into the house. The choir was destined pastor to kill me. And so after them down the road, we take my money, take my ring, take my watch, take the chains, take everything, take the things on the shop. Then the boy said, they remember said, them said, they won't kill me. So I had a letter from the ground with my foot tied up on the top table of my mouth. The boy then said, come see me at home. The boy then said, me who go on. I try and get wet. Me can't talk to tell the boy I serve and I can get wet. Me ashamed of him. The leader of the gang looked for the boy and said to the boy, Soldier, take up the boy. But we were busting heads. Then they said, I'm going next door, I'm going next door, mama, the next door, my sister, the next door, my brother, the next door. We said, Me and I will start to see myself in the newspaper. And the boy is there and bust me in. And then I go next door. But when them don't rap, and then they pick up the boy, we're going to bust him in. From next door, pass. I hear mama say, Oh, oh, oh. 
Every time we try to go and push um, zinc face our little coat to see who it is. I went to the late night here to visit one of our sisters who had a bed in the family. And I go in there one night, and when I go in there one night, I, I jump to the one COVID because the place are real hot. But I have to go. And when I went, we said every man put the car in a black. And as soon as the car I drive up, we said when just a walk over the corner and I pick up them position. No country can run so. No community can live so. That's not how God designed it. God designed it for people to live in free, people to live in peace and harmony. It's like them liars. God not can the put up Jamaica and the church is here. One for Prime Minister was a national guy. Come on, look at the neighbor and say, it's lying and telling. Don't go and mash up that lie. So, God go and hold so much people at ransom. Jamaica has almost 3 million people. And the majority of us are law abiding people. citizens. And one handful of the boy, one handful of them. You know, my version of police step so we can't talk everything. And my boy came up police camera. So some boy beat some shot up on him at a particular place. And he just come to him and was going to talk to him to say, and he said to the side, and the side, you know, so he was going to go and walk around the sun. And the side said, come and go around. And the boy then beat several shot up the police with the high ball weapon. And my Christian church brought a deacon. And then Sarge just rolled it and just caught with the 16. When the boy had rolled, come up from the 16, and said, Mama, police don't kill me. Then only one want kill police. <laughs> How oh, you want to kill police? And when you say police, you're bad with Mama. <laughs> police tell you all the time. The way police will live. The first thing that you're bad. One gun boy was torment, uh, rock foot or uh, rock foot, not rock foot, uh, I was stolen in that general community. New Year's Eve, three dead one time in a rock foot. On the first day of 2019, they killed three one time in a rock foot. And 27 hours now, and 2017, there was zero dead. And 2019, three from one day. And you have one young girl named Richie Poole. You all know they go to the news. What police said, he was the most wanted in Jamaica, Richie Poole. And when the police get worried, don't let them take a bit. The first thing he start to do, he start peeping. And he might have a lot of pampas. He goes up in pants. He goes up in food. Look at them. They are caught. You is not the God. Mama tell me, one day she walk in the door lava. Mama coming from Western Union. And when mama coming from Western Union and she walk in. And I one mind said, so Mama is not one mind, it's the Holy Spirit. Mama said one mind said so she must look behind her. And when she looked behind her, she said, boy a trailer. And mama said, don't look at that boy a trailer. Mama crossed the road, <clears throat> boy crossed the road. Mama crossed my road, boy crossed my road. Mama walk fast, boy walk fast. Mama slow down, boy slow down. Mama just turn and use the weapon. Mama said, you put my sister. Let me tell you something. Get the Lord of Jesus. If I say it's good. Mama said, the Lord of Jesus. One young mama look. Mama just get prayed for. I remember that she had something in her hand because God said to Abraham and Moses, where you have your hand? Mama never had nothing in her hand but her purse. And the money when they picked his head and she got them to pick it. I said to them, send them there to Western Union. I'm boy, no one work, I want to take them on money. I'm going to have the blood. <laughs> you are more than conscious. You I'm poor than conqueror. No fear. We don't want a hero. No play no hero. But don't be 
be afraid to use what you have. So let me ask you, what you have in your arsenal? I want to hear, what do you have in your arsenal? I want to hear what you have in your arsenal. I want to hear what you have on your sleeve. I want to hear the instrument that you use. Has not used its power. The church still stands power. And in case they forget, because one time, the day I was going to a church, they used to say I was a church. Why did they say we're a church? Because every time somebody comes, you can't come in and leave up. I'm going to lean up. And we don't serve like a God. If you're coming to lean up, you're going straight. Well, the church is a prayer with the Holy Ghost. Come on, church. Say Holy Ghost. The church is a prayer with the Holy Ghost. In case they forget, it is still the Holy Ghost church. In case they forget, it is still Holy Ghost, still a powerful church. It is still a sanctified church. The new things of a church are a warrior church. Why? Because they know what they want to do. And because they know what they want to do. And we don't have to work. We don't think we are a superior warrior man. We don't think we are a warrior man. We don't know what they want. We can eat the cheese. We don't even know who the man is. 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 It's a clean up the school bill. It's full of the most who we are. And who we are thinking. And who we are believing. Jesus Christ. And your pastor said, a fine man's church. If we can read college of this church. If we can be past this church, this church, and it's all their mentality, and it's all their doings, we then need Jesus. I showed us to the church, and you know But we have some people. Even when we go in the we have people who can see it. We have been to the church. Yes, we have more there. Even though we don't know who they are, we see who they are. We know when they are who they are coming. We believe in God. The Bible. My God, the Lord says, let the Lord let the Lord say to somebody, to make God forget me, Jesus. Me, Jesus. Me, Jesus. Me, Jesus. Me, Jesus. So I'm going to declare today and we're going to be honest today. Instead of doing some reading of the notion of decree and declare. And I have learned and understand that when you declare certain things in the atmosphere, it, it gets into the realm of heaven. And when it gets into the realm of heaven, something supernatural happens in the literal. And I want us to penetrate heaven today. Oh, come on, are you with me somewhere? Are you ready to look at me and If you're ready to look at me and if you're ready to stand with me, if you're ready to look at me, are you ready to look at me and if you're ready to look at me and if you're ready we're going to decree and declare that Jamaica is going to be a crime free. Even if we're going to get this to 100%. But at the top of everything we 
where we can live with not that we can live with but we can say to them who are making them for the high crime and violence. I want us to the creed elements to get into the realms of heaven that full be Jamaica that the blood let him with seeds of the Come on, let's go in the field, come on. I don't hear you, come on, I don't hear you. I don't hear you, 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 I don't hear you. But the young man who perpetrated crime and violence upon the country and told me that they would surrender their lives to God. We have created the clear today in the atmosphere in the name of Jesus. Come on, church. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. A young man will bury their guns in the pack, bring their guns to the police or the authority and surrender their lives to what we agree. And we declare it today in the name of Jesus. I read the paper yesterday that the violence in the 11 miles area have now spilled over into the Grand Spell and creeping into Yalas. We said, Come to a grip right now. You violence in the 11 miles, you can't sell it right here. And the pudding cream is going to be in the name of Jesus. 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 That no one will bark and shoot us in. We don't even have it. For we decree it, and they can't rise it in the name of Jesus. They can't rise it in the name of Jesus. We don't say they are, but they can't rise it in the name of Jesus. After we are in there, we are going everywhere. One of us is going to shoot us in, but they can't rise it in the name of Jesus. All of the horizon and the church is here. All of the horizon. When they rise at the work of the worship, I'm going to church of sweet. And when I want to know y'all about summer, we don't want to miss this blessing. All of the horizon will have to push church and the serve of God Almighty. We're going to have, we're going to the community. Like every other community in Jamaica. But we feel free and we declare the atmosphere that they can rise in. Now I point the hands to the 60 our own up. As just as we had Bible study to the night, shut up our own son. We don't know which one our own but God know which one. That's a wrong song. I hear 16. Talk to him. In the atmosphere. Speak it in the realm of the spirit. Speak it in the realm of God and the realm. It happened in the atmosphere. In 16. I wrong song. The blood of Jesus is against you. Put up the gun. Dash on the gun. So when they get left with God, for their own son, do it here, eight miles, seven miles, eight miles, nine miles, ten miles, eleven miles, grand spell, gas, white horse, part of sight, see what we got, one thing, the one of our son, the blood of Jesus. Come on, ladies and gentlemen, every good man, every young man, come on, stop with the church. You have one place. You have one place. Men, thank well. Thank well. Say thank well. 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 Thank well.
those who have not yet surrendered their life to the Lord. Today is a good day. My sermon should have been no more excuses. And it was going to come from the book of St. John, chapter 5. And there was a young man, there's a man who was crippled for 13 years. And so the Bible says that Jesus one day went to this pool in Jerusalem that is in the Hebrew tongue called Bethesda. And Bethesda means house of mercy. But when he got there, he saw a lot of people. Some lame, some blind, some crippled. My three points today was going to be what are you doing at the pool? My second point was going to be why are you staring at the pool? And so Jesus looked at the man, the Bible said he was sick in that position for 38 years. Is there someone who is 38 years old here today? And you're afraid that you're coming, you know they're coming? You're 38. So come here, not here. I'm not going to be in a flash. Anybody who is 38? If not, you want to come now? If you want to, man. If you want to, man. So the man was sick for 38 years. But when Jesus got there, oh man, thank you for telling us your age. You too, Miss Wilson, because women don't like to tell their age. You don't like to tell your age, huh? You what? So, man, let's do it, son. Is that? Wow, so much better than you. Come on this line, man. I'm not going to do it. 38 years. Any other 38 years? Can we show you their age? <laughs> Any other 38 tell me? You the wrong one? You part? <laughs> you Maxi? Mr. Lanza, you sir? I'm Mr. Lanza, join the group? You to this show? Wow. Any other? So the man was sick for as long as all these people are. Can you imagine? The man was sick for as long as these people are. Long time on the night, I'm sure. Let's see how we late seventies. So the man was sick for say from 1979, 78, over to 2019. But not only that, he was there, but there were other people who were there too. You know, so many divine people. Pastor, I'm going to speak up, man. I'm going to speak up, man. Oh, Pastor, take a lady. Jehovah, take a lady. Peter, come to take a lady. One of the 13 years old. Don't take my wife. Jehovah, who are you? Uncle, who are you? 
as somebody.
You see, she's one of the few female places. She lays blocks. She renders the wall. She tiles the floor. Did you know that? Ah, uh, she's a great one, Mason. But she sits there, you would not know. You're, you're better now, dear, than what you are right now. And God wants to speak into your spirit and to let you know that you should not box yourself in the little box that you put yourself. But I want you to walk out of that box, come up with your hands in the head. Walk out of your box. Claim it. It's your eyes. Walk it out. Give your hands. Give your hands. Walk out of your box. 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 Walk out your box. Yes, sir. It's not a really not church. We don't read it. We just study it by the Spirit. So, Lanza. Sir. So, Lanza is better than what you are. You're bigger than the people in Jesus Christ. You are the one who can push away the body in it. So, Lanza. Come on.
we have this Hallelujah. 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 And then we have this lovely lady. We believe that God sent her here today. Yes. I don't recall her see in the church. You may have come and I didn't see. But why did you come today? Of all the days, why today? Of all the days, why did why did Jesus show up at the pool? Of all the days, why did he show up at the pool? He showed up at the pool to grant divine favor. Why do I believe your last slide? I hope I'm wrong. You see another church? God wants to do something. Something. I don't know. But you, you, you know what you've been praying about tonight. You ask him for something. Something specific. And you're waiting for it to be to you know my life. It's going to be nice. Jay was getting one, you're getting seven chairs. Some chairs for all the people who I picked up. I'm wrapping up now for seven chairs, Jay God. Because I want to demonstrate something. There's some chairs there, but use them, use them. Chairs inside. I want to demonstrate to you something that happened. You see, the problem was not the pool. Yes, the problem is being at the pool. Also, you can have your seat, please. You can have your seat, please. You see, the, the problem is not the pool. In the first place, it shouldn't be. We have a very good want to pass it from my own Yes. One more. I don't see too much of it. Oh! 
Their hands are dead until your life will not be the same. Your life will not be the same.
I'm indeed thankful that you're never tired of hearing from us, your children. We thank you for today. We thank you for your people who have gathered here. Dear Lord, we worship you. I endorse my God the statement that you are not here by chance. Where you are concerned, there is nothing more that happened by chance. Hallelujah. 
in the state of need so that she can be delivered. In the name of Jesus, we repent the forces of darkness that come against her right now. We curse every plan of the adversary. My God, that he has in store for her this blessed hour. And we clear your love of well in the name of Jesus. Bless the children among us today. My God, I pray in the future, the ones whom the enemy, my God, try to confuse them and use them to create men in our land today. We pray a special blessing upon them. We pray a special blessing for the Shukas in community. We pray that peace may not die again, Lord God, I pray. We pray that our community might take pattern from Shukas so that we might have peace in our land. I pray for the visitors, Lord God, especially those who are not seen. I commit them into your cheer. Why not today? That is the question, my God. I pray that your Holy Spirit will live on your mind. Why not today? Hallelujah. Today is the day of salvation. Salvation means that you are safe and secure. Salvation means that you are assured. I pray, Lord, that you will bring that understanding within your hearts and mind, that they will recognize that, especially in this day and time, they need to be secure. Help them, my God, to cry out right now, I heal thy Let them yield to me. Let them surrender to me, recognizing that what's ahead of the heart. Yes, Lord, as problems, my solution, you can fix it. I commit them into your cheer, and we declare it done. Jesus, we thank you for our glorious day in your presence. We thank you for Pastor Mitchell. We thank you for your anointing power. Blessed Lord, we pray that you will anoint him for another time. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord, when I need this place or in another place, continue to use him for your glory. Continue to use your children. For your glory, all of us we have called to work in this your vineyard, the priest, even the musicians, the ushers, and all of those mighty God who are called to the work. Grant us the tools we need. Anoint us with your power. Fill us, my God, I pray with your spirit. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank the Lord. There is everything, Lord, that we feel about to the right now. We pray that in your infinite wisdom and mercies, you will have seen unto us. Remember our viewers, my God and Facebook, I'm sure that they have their share of desires. I'm sure that they were blessed today. But, oh God, we are only one flesh and we have needs. You are the one who are able to fill all of our needs. So as we look to you today, Lord God, I pray that you address every situation. Yes, but we believe it. Yes, Lord, for we have to in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. We thank you, Jesus. Yes.
You have made it up with Father the Lord. We want to just step forward right here. We want to pray with you specially. God bless the name of the Lord and the Lord may keep you until you perform the last right of baptism. Because the enemy will continue to pursue you. He will not let you go free. All we can do is pray for you. But it is God that keeps you. Is there any? We just don't have to go walk out here. We want to pray for you. We want to see you. We want to see you with you. And bless the name of the Lord.
Because this is what we're looking for. This is my life. This is what makes me happy. To see people that know. So when you have your life, the Lord has inspired me to walk on and on and to do more and more. Pastor Kane and myself, we are honored. We are honored. We are honored.
May God's best blessings be upon you all. Remember tomorrow night we will be at the Church of Lord's Seventh day in White Horses as we part with our sister's church over there as they seek to bring souls to Christ. All our friends who have viewed us, who have watched us live, and those who will be us later, happy Sabbath, God bless you. We know you have choices, but you chose to you know, have a back with us. And uh, we want to see you special way. Thank you. And may God's best blessings be up on you. And so until next week, we stay on our page. COGJ, shoot us in. And visit us at, on Instagram and Twitter. COGJ, shoot us in. And on YouTube, COGJ, shoot us in. Happy Sabbath. God bless you, everybody. So, um, uh, Pastor Gay and uh, myself, the praise and worship team did get a chance today to you know, do their piece and this is a lot for them. And definitely, we'll see them back again. <laughs> so, Pastor Gay and myself, we're going to take a lot to meet with you um, at the door. But before you do that, you know, I want to uh, especially uh, ask the Lord to cover Brother Jer Jermaine. He was just at the altar with us. He's a young man who was born and grew in the church. And I'm happy that he's coming home. We have some business. And so, he's in the, the funeral arrangement business. And so, uh, please feel free to get his business card. In the event you know of someone who will need his service, I will pray that God will cover him, cover his endeavors. And as young men like Jermaine in this age group that are perpetrating crime and violence, and when we see a young man who stepped out to be an entrepreneur, he deserves a hand. <laughs> and God bless you, God bless your business. May God cover your business, your office, your business, your, office, your, business, your staff, and may your still master in the middle of the heavens. Happy Sabbath, everybody. God bless you. Jesus is my